Hi, John. This is Apollo. And um, when we first started riding, he was a puppy. And the first thing I did was actually set this on the floor and let him get familiar with just sitting on the cockpit on the floor, right? And he got real familiar with it. And then we started doing like just a little gentle ride around the block and so forth. And he was never really scared. Um, in fact, he loves, you know, what I say is it's similar to a dog sticking their head out the window, right? He's sniffing, he loves, he, he gets up and he sniffs all the air and he looks around and everything like that, right? But he's a golden doodle and golden doodles have a lot of separation anxiety, most of them do, and they're kind of just nervous by nature. So one of the things he does, he's phrasing the other way, of course, is um, from the first time we rode to every single time we ride, he takes his paw and he just he just anchors himself to my back. He holds the, the lower part of my back. He just kind of puts his paw there and he just sits there. And the first time he did it, I was like, why is he sticking his paw into my back? That's kind of weird. But the truth is like, I realized he was staying connected to me. He was feeling, okay, I'm with you, buddy, you know? And uh, so every time we ride, he just kind of hangs out like that. And that's his kind of, you know, love language there that he has. Right, Paula? Down, down, good boy. Good boy, good down. And so after we ride, yeah, exactly. So I take his front, goggles off and he has to have a little celebration where I go, good ride, good ride. And he goes crazy. Yeah. <laughs> if, if I'm at home and I need to kind of run a quick errand or do something, run down the grocery store and I leave and I don't take him with me, I'll start the bike and he'll hear that bike. And according to uh, my wife, he goes bananas. He runs around the house barking because he's like, I should be going with you, right? So it's kind of funny. He uh, he doesn't like to get cheated out of a ride. But uh, yeah, at the end of the day, he'll he'll come up to my office and I'll and if I haven't if it's six and I haven't taken him on a ride yet, he'll start he'll start clawing and kind of sniffing. And the funniest thing he does is he's learned how to make little motorcycle noises. So he goes kind of rrr, 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 like this, which is like, come on, chop, chop. We got to go on a ride. So.